Do you know what's happening in Tigray, Ethiopia? If not, it's probably because authorities have deliberately shut down the internet to block the flow of information. The shutdown is having an immense impact on my life, and I doubt if words can really express it. It feels like a worse nightmare. With killings, starvation, sexual violence, and massive displacement are commonplace in Tigray, not knowing whether my family members who were sick or are alive at all was excruciating. The worst part is that it still continues. The inability to call ambulances is costing the lives of many pregnant and laboring mothers and patients with acute illnesses. A mother bled to death because she could not access emergency care. My mom does not even know where she put her phone down in the house. Now she checks it every few minutes. They never did find out how our families are faring as devastating to her. Now she has dark circles and wrinkles under her eyes. Even her bright smile has dimmed. She laughs, but not like she used to. Since the start of the conflict in November 2020, authorities have weaponized internet and telecommunication shutdowns to control information, censor populations, and cover up atrocities, including mass killings and sexual violence against women and girls. The blackout is endangering lives, fueling violence, and exacerbating the humanitarian crisis. The world should know what's happening in Tigray. Help us spread the word. Put pressure on authorities responsible for the shutdown to immediately restore internet access and international institutions, including the African Union, to intervene.